hey, good morning, Tony Didante, 360 Life Transformations. Hey, we are excited. Five days from now, we have our Agility and Disruption Summit, uh, headed up by uh, world famous author Charlene Lee, The Disruption Mindset, Hannah Inman, Wired for Authenticity, Wired for Dis Disruption. Gene Murtha, senior executive from Mattel, that's going to work through some transformation work I did with him overseas. Um, Quinn Farrell, who's going to take us through EQ on steroids. And, um, and finally, John Werner, who is the agile expert in the space. So I've worked hard to get these people together, and we are going to put on the workshop of workshops. Here's a big surprise. Uh, through my friends, uh, my Special Forces friends and the Brian Bill Foundation, um, we have secured uh, a group of Special Forces officers who are transitioning into corporate life. And they're going to bring their knowledge on the battlefield about resilience and ambiguity and paradox and fear and teach us. And we're going to teach them about life in the corporate world. So what an opportunity to exchange ideas and learnings, all in a safe place, honest public conversations. That's exciting. Hey, uh, I'm here also to tell you, I was thinking about this today. I'm heading to the dojo. Uh, I'm here to uh, train with these special forces guys. I'm half their age, uh, they're half my age. And um, even though I get beat up, I learn. So there's something about having impediments in your life that you still learn. That's what this workshop is about. It's real-time learning in the post-COVID world. So I had a friend, late great friend, uh, Robin Williams. And here's what he taught me. He taught me that you have to look at life differently. How do you do that? So remember the movie. Remember his famous movie, right? Uh, Dead Poet Society. When he stood up on the desk, I'm gonna stand. I'm gonna sit up on a stand up on a rickety old chair, right? Because this is all about balance. I have to unlearn how I normally would deal with this chair, and I have to get myself focused and centered. So Ryan, so Robin Williams, when he was on top of that desk, he looked out at the students. He says. Why do I stand up here? And this is the whole presence of our workshop. We stand up here to see the world differently. We stand up here to learn how to focus on something new and to, unlet, to unlearn other stuff that makes no sense to us anymore. That's why I stand up here today. Because just when you think you know it, COVID came. Just when you were so sure of who you were, COVID came. And COVID was a monster, is a monster, will continue to be a monster. So what made you successful in the past does not guarantee you success in the future. We need to learn. Well, we're giving you an opportunity to learn from the best by the best. Field tested. Years of experience, all in the same room, at the same time, learning how to be successful post-COVID. So here's what I'm asking for you to do. I want you to attend this workshop. I want you to take notes. I want you to learn. I want you to ask questions. I want you to strive for your own voice. I want you to break out of who you were. I don't want you to do what, what uh, Robin used to say to me. Don't walk around like a bunch of grapes, right? Don't walk around like a bunch of grapes. Hey, at the end of the day, my friends, I don't have this all figured out, but I know this is my lane. I know how to make transformation happen and how to make learning stick. October 28th and 29th, from 12 to four, come and learn about disruption, agility, growth in leadership. Do it inclusively. I love you guys. I love this work. Carpe diem. Seize the day.